All right guys, so we just got dropped off here at the airport and you're probably wondering where we're headed next. Normally I drive everywhere, but not this time. It's a little bit more cost effective to fly, rent a car from Florida and drive it back to Indiana. So here we go, we're on our way on this adventure. Actually, I've never been to this airport before. It's uh, Kentucky, uh, Ohio, Cincinnati airport. Cincinnati Northern Kentucky International Airport. Departure gates. All right, let's see where we are headed to. How about that right there? Just got the rental car. Man, Orlando's airport is beautiful, y'all. Please proceed to Alamo customer service booth. Okay, Alamo down this way. I'm gonna get the car and then I will jump back in with you guys and see what the deal is. But I'm gonna go to Alamo and pick up the car. Yeah. Tampa, Bradenton area, here we come. I can't wait. It's gonna be exciting. Hey, it's exciting for the personal brand. It's exciting for you guys to know that we're collaborating with bigger names. You know, I, I've been out here for four years and I've done my, you know, I've done my best to network and, and, and climb the ladder of influencers i guess you could say or network my way through to some of the you know some of the top you know the top five percent on youtube or you know social media across the board and i'll tell you what you know it's it's humbling to know that i'm working with some of the top top people so i, I wouldn't say top people sorry i i shouldn't put it like that because there's no hierarchy really uh I should say some of the well-known influencers, the people that have put in the groundwork for, you know, for others. Uh, so this is a this is a huge opportunity for us to collaborate with others and, you know, do some big stuff. So on to Bradington we go. All right, guys, this might not look like a very familiar place, but you guys are gonna know a lot about it by the end of this video. Parker, what's up, man? Dude, we are in Florida right now, and I have possibly what could be the first Isuzu 4JJ1 that's going in a long tail riverboat in America at our feet. Yeah, literally, at our feet. Look at this. We have managed to disassemble and completely ship an Isuzu 4JJ1 all the way from Bangkok, Thailand to Sarasota, Florida. Uh, we couldn't bring the engine in completely assembled because it would not meet EPA standards. However, there is a loophole that since we're going to be using it for off-road use, right. we can, and we completely disassemble it, that we were able to ship it over in about like 15 to 20 boxes. Yeah, that's about what we just uh, disassembled. Winston's still cleaning up. Cleaner up, he's Winston. Not doing a very good job, though. Now he's sniffing it out. Yeah, so, uh, you know, we just went through and opened up all the boxes and 
You've got a long drive. You're going back to Indiana to assemble this thing. We're going to take this back to Wagler Competition, and we're going to assemble all this, ship some parts over to Exergy, and have them work on the wiring harness. The wiring harness. The yep. Inject, go through the injectors. Yep. Talk to them about a wastegate. That. Uh, yeah, dude. Lots of figuring out to do. This thing did not come with an instruction manual. <laughs> Kia. Kia. Yeah, IKEA. IKEA, yeah. Do you I, come with an IKEA instruction manual on how to No, it, so. not at all. It's all right. It's all right. We'll figure it out, I'm sure. And it's very well off better in your hands than mine. That's for sure. Uh, my hands are a little bit more dirty than yours are right now. So the definitely. Life, man, definitely. Kind of sort of yeah, doing. for sure. But no, it's a, it's definitely in good hands. We're gonna take it up to Jeremy at Waggler Competition, yep. and he's up for the challenge. Dude, he, I'm pumped. I'm really stoked. He's definitely been uh, interested in this type of stuff ever yeah. since the videos have been coming out. Yeah. And he's like, "Hey, how can we be part of that build?" And I was like, "You know what? I know Parker from Race Week, yeah. and I know that I can, you know, work through the network and get in contact with them." And well, I'm super stoked, man. I yeah. mean, I know y'all put out some great, amazing products, and uh, you know, I've asked around friends in the area about helping me assemble this thing, and I haven't gotten a lot of great feedback just because nobody's as you know, well educated and knowledgeable as as you, the team that you were with. Yeah. So I'm really excited that it's in your hands, and it's kind of hard for me to let it go because we literally just met right? today. But, yeah, uh, for reals. Hey, man, you got to do it, right? That's life. Gotta, yep. You got to take a risk, and it'll pay off. I'm sure. I'm well, sure. if and if the boat doesn't make it for some crazy reason, then we have a sick engine we can put in like a burnout car. We do. You know? We definitely do. Or that Hellcat right there. Put the Suzu in the Hellcat. <laughs> The engine is pretty beefy in that thing. Right? Yeah, well. It definitely need, I need a new car. The car is absolutely cooked. It's cooked. It's terrible. Ah. But the engine's good. The engine's still good. Hey, Yeah. that's what matters the most. But anyways, guys, we're going to package all this back up into these 15 boxes here and take it back up to Indiana. So oh, yeah. let's get on the road. All right, guys. We got the minivan loaded. with a whole bunch of parts. Good luck. Alrighty, so we just left Parker's house. It, uh, I don't know, it's about 8.30 at night on Tuesday. We just left Parker's house. Uh, you know, we hung out a little bit, collaborated, you know, throwing ideas back and forth to everybody throwing ideas back and forth to each other. Uh, I, I see a lot of collaboration uh, working with each other in the future. This is just one project that we're gonna, you know, work together now on, but no, I see I see a friendship developing for sure. Really nice guy. Uh, but anyways, hey, we're gonna head back to Wagler Competition and get this uh, motor laid out on the table and uh, go from there. So the, yeah. Anyways, 13-hour uh, drive back to Indiana. We appreciate you guys following along with this video. I know it's not a lot of content, but hey, I just wanted to announce the collaborations here. Uh, you guys can go over to Parker's channel, Teeth and Turbos, and look at uh, us, you know, unboxing the the engine and all that stuff. So that's all on his channel. I didn't, uh, you know, I, that's not my content to, to have my, uh, you know, my content is going to be assembling the engine so you guys will see that part also but anyways go over to teeth and turbos check it out uh, it's uh, going to be a great video but other than that hey warp speed to indiana let's go Yeah, put my game 